These are exciting times at Axis. Our chosen design direction for our audio products is working really well and we are currently working on new, cool audio products. We are making a complete audio solution with many capabilities where two-way communication is one of them. Instead of keeping people safe by monitoring them through a lens, we are now able to interact and communicate with people. One important thing that we as designers must consider is that these interactive products need to blend into various contexts when they are in a non-interactive state and be perceived as objects made for interaction when they are used for this. One important interactive feature is the LED, which we have placed below the front mesh of the product. This makes the LED completely invisible when the product, for example, is playing background music and it wakes up and gives the product an interactive face when someone on the other end wants your attention. We call this hidden smartness. We have a baseline in our general design direction. This is our foundation in everything we do. Also connected to our Scandinavian design heritage and our everything for a reason approach. We had to adapt our design direction though to be able to make a scalable audio design direction to fit all current and coming audio products. We had to find a balance between a unique, recognizable brand identity building design and a subtle, calm design. Our speaker mesh is a perfect example of that. So one of our key stakeholders is of course the installer. And we as designers try to interact with them as much as possible to learn from them, to learn what they need and what they desire. We implemented snap-in installations, uh, one-hand grips, uh, graphics on the product to guide the installer and so on. It is an interesting time to work with design at Axis and when it comes to network audio we have only just started this journey.